Watson. And I'm Rick Young. This is our volume one of a tape series of takedowns and throws based for submission style fighting and body tutu style practitioners. It's also designed for judo practitioners and Brazilian jiu jitsu practitioners. We hope you enjoy the tape. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, the first takedown that we're going to work is a high body tackle. Okay, your entry is head outside, uh, stepping into the center, center penetration. Okay, so this is called uchikomi or setups. What we're going to do is your partner's going to stand just like this, and I'm going to drop. Okay, my objective here is to take him and go one arm's length away. Okay, divide his body in half, step out to the side. Okay, I'm going to keep my body nice and low because this is the, sh the uh, level where I'm going to shoot from. My head is going to hit him, so my forehead is going to glance off and my ear is going to be nice and tight. Okay, so when I step, number one is one arm's length, drive his body, drop it in half. Okay, cock the knee, hands here, step up to the center, which is on the front ball line. So I'm going to step up and I'm going to come in and back. Or I'm going to come in here, or I'm going to come here, double leg, or latch into the butt. So there's basically three positions. I can come under the arm and around the body here. I can come two hands on the back of the knee or latch under the rump. Okay, so the position is just like this. Okay, I'm going to step. Okay, so the entry is the first part, okay? And what you want to do is rep it over and over and over, like maybe a hundred times right, a hundred times left for your warm-ups, okay? The, the key on this, again, is the arm length, okay? You don't want to shoot from too far, okay? You want to shoot from arm's length away. You want to divide the body in half. You don't want to shoot from here. You want to divide the body in half so you have the angle where you're shooting, okay? And most of the time you'll be circling, okay? So I'll be circling for the shot, and then you're going to wait. Now since it's body tutor style fighting, the person will probably be punching. So the first thing we do is teach the correct position for the takedown. Secondly, we put the punches into it. Okay. So my objective here, one more time, is I'm going to drop, cut that in, step up, step up, penetrate, my ear touches, and then come out. Okay. So the footwork going to look like this for the high repetition. I'm going to start out here. I'm going to step, step in. And the hands do not come wide. They come in tight. Or in. Same thing on the other side. Same thing. Step back, step up and in. Okay. Good. Now, what I'm going to do is when I make contact, I get the body. I'm going to step up, step in. Okay, now I change my angle. We call turning the corner. I go to my left. So it looks like I'm going, like I'm going to do a fencing thrust, just like that. Okay, so when I enter here and I make contact, boom, and I'm in, now I push off and drive with my head. That's going to offset his body. Okay, same thing. I enter, I use his legs and my head to steer. Okay, third, same thing. When I get here, I can pick up and drive. Okay? Okay, so, one, step up and drive. Two, double leg and drive. Three, he balances, so I can't do it, so I lock under the butt and I can pick up. I can throw left, right, or back. Okay, the finish on this is your positioning. If you have good positioning, we say, oh, say, call me. If you have good positioning, you can strike. If you have good positioning, you can lock. If you lose a position or end up in a bad position and get reversed, that's not good. So our objective is to take down, control, hold dominant or top position, and then start our, start our attacking, okay? So when we take down, there's five, five basic positions. Number one is when I take him down, I don't really want to end up between the legs. And if I do, I start to punch or I'm going to attack the legs or try to pass the guard. 
Second thing I don't want to end up in is uh, half guard. Half guard, I have to fight to get my leg loose, okay? My objective is to clear his legs automatically so I can attack the upper body, okay? So when we do this, and I take him down, I come in, and I drive and take him down, okay? I've already cleared the legs, so from here, I have what we call crossbody or Yokoshiho Gatami. Your second objective as we go to would be Kazuri Kezigatami. These are attacking positions for more submission positions, style positions. Okay, I have Kezigatami. Okay, variations of. Okay, this would be a variation of. Okay, we have four quarter hold down, north and south position. Okay, all of the hips down. We have knee mount. Very prominent position for striking, and then we have mount position. Okay, and this is for punching and for the ground and pound theory and the submissions. Okay. So when I take him down here, I position. Okay. Usually after we take them down in position, he's got five seconds to get out. If you can't escape within five seconds, then I dominate the position. Okay. So, take down. Uh, when I'm shooting, I don't want to run into the bridge. And that's this, or that's this. Okay. So when I drop, I've got to clear it. And the first way is I just jam it up. Okay. Second way is I bring my head and I scoop inside. Okay. So I either scoop it or jam. Okay, when I do that, that's what I do. Okay. I jam it up. To position. If you like this video, like, share, and subscribe. And hit the little bell for notifications if you like the video, this one, and more like it.